All right. Which one of these should we wear today? What color are you guys feel like wearing today, guys? Got the blue hoodie, blue t-shirt. My other blue hoodie, this one's really old, red. Um, what type of day we feel like doing today? Maybe red. I don't think I wear red in a while. That's one. Oh! What's going on guys? Welcome back to Vlogmas day number 10. Wow, 10 days of vlogs. Thank you guys so much for rocking with me so far. I hope you guys are all enjoying the videos. So today, as you can see, we're currently in the living room. You guys can see the Christmas tree and some of the stuff behind me. And um, for today's video, I'm actually gonna catch up on some things I have to do around the house that we have to fix. Some um, light switches that I have to cover over and a couple other things. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys everything now. I'm a little bit tired from that intro we were filming, but hopefully you guys did enjoy it. And welcome back to another vlog. Let's go ahead and get this started. You guys see the Christmas tree is looking beautiful. Um, a couple other upgrades around the room too. You guys are gonna have to kind of just stay with me and watch the final vlog of this video, which will be showing off all of the decorations that my beautiful wife have done around the house. Everything looks amazing. Okay. So if you guys saw the previous video, we did build this yesterday. If you guys didn't see that, go check it out. But um, yeah, let's go ahead and get started with our day today. We don't really need the lights on to be honest. Alexa, turn off the Christmas lights. Okay. Thank you. So that's set to a schedule, so it comes on every day, I think around 5 p.m. and then it turns off around 1 a.m. but you could set it to do whatever you want it to do. So for today's video, um, we are going to be just installing these wall covers for the um, smart switches that we installed around the house. A couple of them had this problem, as you guys can see, this looks terrible with this, uh, these cuts, but this wasn't from me installing it. The builders of the house, they actually use oversized wall plates and they cut like really terrible. I guess they're probably rushing because they're building like a hundred houses, so they don't really, I don't know, they're just rushing or whatever. So, um, the switches came with standard wall plate covers. We're gonna replace them and put up this oversized one, which is what they originally had. And as you can see, the oversized one should completely cover. Now, the cool thing about these smart switches, as you see, it turns the light on. It also lights up when it's on, but another cool thing that I could do is tell Alexa to turn them on, or you can use any smart home device you could use google home you could use alexa or any of the other ones as well so just just to show you guys how it works here alexa turn on hallway light okay bam so that is how it works if you guys would like to check that out i'm actually going to record a tutorial on my other channel um it's going to be called tech by ace it's currently ace on demand but i'm going to rename that channel tech by ace and that's going to be like tutorials and stuff like that all around tech so you guys are the first to know about it nobody else knows about this besides myself and mrs ace so if you guys are watching this vlog you guys are on the inside of the team you guys know what's going on on all of our channels so congratulations about that but um, if you guys want to check out any of these products, I will link them down below in the video description. It's pretty cool making your house a smart home. Some people is like, ah, is it really necessary? But it's really fun. You can do a lot of stuff with home automation, with timers, and it's just fun telling Alexa what to do. But um, yeah, let's go ahead and start with this. So we just need a flathead screwdriver for both of those. So I'm gonna go into my toolbox here. Now, Mrs. Ace also organized this yesterday, so that's a big help. I guess I'll use this one here. Yeah, this one should be fine. All right. So I'm gonna put you guys down for a second so I can start unscrewing these, and then we can cover up these terrible holds from the builders. Thank you. 
All right, so got the original plates off. Or now put on the oversized ones now. So let's open that up. You guys kind of see how the switches look here. So these are the switches we installed. And as you can see, when they cut this out, they made it really rough. So that's why we need the oversize to fix them. Not really to fix them, just to make them look better. So that looks much better already. All right, got it installed, looking good. So we are done with that one. I have a couple more to do around the house, so let me put this one down. The rest of them are two packs. I think I have, is it one down here? Two, two down here. So we also have to do this one, same thing. So we just use the oversized to cover those imperfections. And the last one's over here. Same thing, oversized will cover all of those imperfections. So I'm gonna get these two knocked out and then we'll come back and do something else. Um, have to head upstairs and do something in one of the guest rooms too. So I'll finish up this stuff and then I'll see you guys upstairs. You can kind of see the size comparison too between the regular size and then the oversized ones. So if you ever have that problem with rough edges, just get an oversized plate. That is what they are made for. Another one is complete. You can no longer see the rough edges since it is hit by the oversized now. So we have one more down here and I forgot there's actually one more I have to do upstairs too, but I'm gonna skip over the next two. So I'll see you guys upstairs. We're gonna be doing something else. All right guys, so we're in my guest room now and I just have to install something really quick. It's pretty minor. We do have another Alexa in here too. She's all over the place. But uh, we're gonna be installing these USBs um, outlets, which comes in, um, they come with two sides. But we're gonna put one side on this side of the bed and the other one on that side of the bed. So all I have to do is take my drill and just drill it in, super simple. That's done. So now we just have to do that for the other side, but it's pretty simple. It's a nice little thing. Not a necessity, but it's a nice feature to have. And um, when we ordered our nightstands, we ordered all of these at the same time. But our nightstands in our room was a little bit more fancier. They came with them built in from the manufacturer. And we thought it was a pretty cool feature. So we looked these things up. We found them on Amazon and we ordered them for the guest room. If you guys want to check them out, link down below in the video description. Let's go to the other side now.
all right guys so you made it to the end of the video i want to say thank you so much for watching this i really do hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog if you did make sure you guys go ahead and smash that like button leave some comments down below subscribe if you're new and also hit that notification bell so you can be notified whenever we post a new video and guys there is still a lot to do around the house before christmas we got to get so much stuff done so if you guys are enjoying the series you want to see some more definitely let me know by leaving a comment down below in the video description and also thank you guys for you know keeping me um occupied you know while i'm getting everything done it's fun to talk to you guys and then read your comments and everything like that but again thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next one peace